Hey, what's up, YouTube family? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well out there and that you're safe wherever you are. And if you have been following my channel, you would know that I have done a part one of my Dolhan trip in Seoul, South Korea. And in that video, I went ahead to open up the mini brand items. I've got a foodie mini brands and also mini brands itself. Some of the items I have already displayed on the shelves at the back over here and in this video I am going to show you the two fashion pack which I have managed to grab from Toys R Us. This would be the Mimi World fashion pack. In video number one I have uh, explained that I was unable to get the dolls simply because I was actually hoping to purchase them on my third day of the stay or the vacation but that third day happened to be on a Sunday and the Toys R Us that I went to and two other Toys R Us uh, which I went to. So in total, three Toy series I visited on Sunday, all of which were closed. And on Monday, I had to fly back. Of course, I arrived on Friday, three days before that. So these are the items I managed to get on the Friday itself upon arrival. So but anyways, I managed to get this two Mimi style fashion look. I have chosen my uh, Barbie style uh, doll over here to dress in this fashion pack. So the first one I want to show all of you is this one. Now this fashion pack has a more casual look and I think it's really cute. I think I got this for um, 7,501. So it could probably be about 28 ringgit, perhaps. That is around 7 US dollars. So I've got a hat, handbag, a top, a pair of jeans, and also a pair of shoes, sunglasses. And this is how it will look overall. And at the back, you have other collection, which I did not see. So the other one is this one, which I didn't manage to get. I Again, I wanted to get it on Sunday, but uh, well, the ties are closed. These two, not available. These other fashion packs, also unfortunately not available. So this is how it looks from the side over here and this other side. So I'm going to go ahead and unbox this first one uh, because it has this Eiffel Tower looking so you would have this Parisian um, fashion model kind of look. So I'm just going to open this and dress her up. So this is how the doll looks like in the first fashion pack and I have used the background of the box to place it over here because I think it's really really cute but anyways this is how she looks like this would be the hat I think the sewing is not too bad but uh, because the doll's hair is all gelled up I didn't want to mess up her hair but um, this is quite a cute hat now let's take a look at um, her shoes, let's begin with the shoes because it would fit but it is pretty loose as you can see like yeah but I like the details on the shoes it has some uh, details on it but unfortunately it is so so loose on her but the size is alright the opening it's it's okay as you can see it is not snug fitting and moving on to her pair of bell-bottom jeans. This is a cute one, as you can see. Um, I like the denim material and there's a working pocket, which is really nice. These are all the sewing. There are two pockets and both are working pocket. But it is quite tight on her, so as you can see, I'm actually using the very last um, edge of the velcro to hold the jeans together 
So it is quite unfortunate that the jeans are pretty tight on her. Let's talk about her quilted brown bag with gold hardware over here. And the strap is also gold. So it is a soft kind of uh, plastic over here. So I'm just going to put the doll back over there. And you can see it is done very nicely. The details of it is nice. Um, also the back over here, you can see that the realistic um, design on the back and I'm able to open her bag. This is so nice. Mattel, are you even watching this? So, I mean Mattel has quite nice bags but uh, look at this one. Mimi World, uh, which is the brand of this fashion pack, they also have dolls and um, I would say it's an equivalent of um, Korean style Barbie dolls perhaps. This is really nice. Yeah, this is really cute. Um, so Mimi World is somewhat like Lika Chan for the uh, Japanese doll. So Mimi World is like the Korean version. So this would be the back and this would be the top. It fits Barbie pretty much all right. Maybe the sleeve is a little bit short, but everything else is okay. She's able to Velcro the top pretty nicely from top to bottom. I like this look and of course this would be the sunglasses which comes together with the fashion pack. It looks more realistic than the ones from Mattel so I like this look very much. Next up I'm gonna go ahead and open the second fashion pack and we will see how she looks. And this would be the second outfit. I think she is really, really gorgeous in this outfit. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna bring the doll closer to you. Check out how she looks. She is gorgeous, isn't she? So I'm just placing the head like so to give her that high fashion Victorian style but um, yeah this is amazing I love how she looks um, the hat is really nice as well as you can see it's like that straw hat kind of material and inside it is neatly uh, sewn this is a very gorgeous hat and let's take a look at the dress the top of the dress you've got the laces all over and you would see that the sewing is immaculate against the fabric. On the sleeve you've got this organza kind of see-through kind of fabric and you've got lace over here. The back of the dress is like so. I love this polka dot of material here and yeah because it's so snug fitting it doesn't really really close um, together properly I would say but of course you won't be seeing the back and in the front this is how she looks with the sewing like so oh, I love this dress and at the bottom you will have laces and ruffles it is a long dress as you can see like here it goes all the way to a calf and then her bag this is a cute cute bag just a pink ribbon pasted in front like so and there's an opening it is plastic material so that would be her handbag. This would be her shoes. I love this shoes. It has this ribbon detail on it. Soft plastic. It fits her better than compared to the first shoes. 
It's a pastel yellow color. Nice one. I love this pair of shoes. It matches with her bag like that. And oh my gosh, she looks stunning. I can't stop looking at her. Yeah, it's just unfortunate that I do not have other collection of um, the fashion pack because I have also uh, found this booklet in the back of the box and it showcases other type of styles. Oh, I love all of this. Where can I find them? I didn't see them in the toy store, so I don't know where I can get them. So yeah, it's unfortunate. And if I could find them, it would be fantastic. If you know or seen any of this Mimi style fashion look, do leave a comment at the comment section um, below. I'd like to know it from you. So anyhow, this would be the fashion from the Mimi style Mimi world from my Seoul Korea trip. It was a very quick one, but I had so much fun doll hunting. Anyways, thank you very much for joining me to unbox all these items for two parts of the video. Do take care and I'll see you in my next unboxing. Bye for now.